How to enable vSync in Cyberpunk 2077. Have you ever noticed those annoying tears on your screen while playing Cyberpunk 2077? This is known as screen tearing, and it can really ruin the immersion of the game. One of the best ways to fix this is by enabling vSync. But where do you find this setting? First, you need to go into the game's settings. Now, you might think that the vSync option would be under the graphics settings, but surprisingly, it's not. You need to navigate to the video settings instead. Yes, it's a bit hidden, but once you're there, you'll see the vSync option. To enable vSync, simply toggle it on. The next step is crucial. You need to match the vSync setting to your monitor's frame rate. For example, if your monitor is running at 120 Hz, set the vSync to 120 Hz as well. This helps ensure that the game's frame rate is synchronized with your monitor's refresh rate, reducing screen tearing significantly. It's also worth noting that even if the game isn't running at the full 120 frames per second, setting vSync to match your monitor's refresh rate can still make the game look much smoother. So go into video settings, turn on vSync, and match it to your monitor's frame rate. This simple tweak can make a big difference in your gaming experience. If you're using an NVIDIA GPU, there's another way to handle this through the NVIDIA control panel. Here, you can manage 3D settings specifically for Cyberpunk 2077. Add the game to the program settings if it's not already listed, then turn on vertical sync and limit your maximum frame rate to match your monitor's refresh rate. For a 60Hz monitor, setting the max frame rate to 58 can help avoid any extra frames that might cause tearing. By following these steps, you can significantly reduce screen tearing and enjoy a smoother, more immersive experience in Cyberpunk 2077.